how to make your own GFX on iPad without wasting any more time. Let's get into it. Okay, so you need to join this game. I'll put a link to it in the description and there's also a picture of it here. So when you join it, you op click on open pose editor and then here you have uh, a bunch of options that you can customize and you can make your own pose. So you need want to click on one of them, your, your character goes into this position and you have like these circles and if you look on the lines you'll see that the blue one makes your hand go up and down the green one makes it spin and the red one makes it go like up and down too so with these circles you just Make your position that you want, and then, okay, so I made my first pose here. It's my right arm, like, going up, it's like pointing at something, and you can always change it later if you don't like, and um, here's a time lapse of me making my pose. Okay, now that I'm done with my pose, you need to go over to a green screen. Go into the green screen. You can zoom in, zoom out, do whatever you want with your character. Pose, pose editor. And click on clear screen for 10 seconds. Then take a screenshot. Next, you would want to go to Ibis Paint X or any other editing app click on my gallery select a new project and then just um, select a square thing next you need to select on this camera thing and then import your photo then um, you can remove the lower layer then okay then next select the magic wand and then select the green bit um the green bit doesn't always uh, like go out like for example my halo here the green bit isn't really going out that well so i'm just gonna leave it um you can select it select the green part again and then cut it out again to make it like more clearer first i'm gonna select all the screen part and then click on the layer and then click on this grid which means clear layer which will like get rid of all the green parts and then what i usually do is to make it like more like less green i click on this remove selection then i click on the black space again to make the green go out even more um i'm just gonna cut out the halo here because um so because it's not really that good for working with green screens because it has like some transparent parts in it and some holes which isn't really that easy to get rid of once you've selected all the green part and you're happy with it click on the layer again and click on clear layer again and then you will like hopefully have no more green parts left and then go to safari and then search for a background go on to images and try finding a background that you like um, I like this one so I'll click on it and then I'll hold the image down 
and then click add to photos then go back to ibis paint x click on the camera thing again and then click on the image and here you can zoom out zoom in do whatever you can also repeat it but i wouldn't recommend doing that because it's not really that smooth so i'll just put this in here like that and click on cancel and then click on the three lines no, hold down the three lines i mean and drag it down so it's at layer one and your character is above it then you can um add this line to your outline to your character if you go on all and then if you like go across you'll find the stroke outer and i like using the white color because i like to make it look like a sticker then you can adjust the width of the outline i'll put it to 10 here click on x and um, you got your gfx so i hope this helped you um i know i'm not really that good at speaking but yeah i hope this helped you and if your character is like cut off in some parts you can just redraw it like that like just to fix the ear there you go this moon is getting cut off so just redraw it and how it originally was and there you go that's how you make your gfx on ipad for free and it's very easy and simple